Okay, this is a quick rundown of troubleshooting on Edge Series pressure gauges. So we've got three lines on the screen here that indicates that the sensor is not being detected. Easy way to check this is to plug in your sensor and it should fire up a number. Once you can see a number here, test it. Showing a vacuum source like that. We want to set up and calibrate it to read zero. So you need to have your sensor in free air like this. I'm going to use the button, go through the menu. We want to stop at the screen where we can see the warning symbol flashing. That one there. Press and hold for a couple seconds. We're going to press one more time. It should read zero. Wait a few seconds. After it stops flashing, it will return to live data. So now we're going to test the vacuum source. Notice the response rate, it's quite low. We can then influence how quickly it responds. So we're going to press and hold while we're reading live data. And you can see this number here flashing. Closer to zero, so zero or one, four, this will have a really fast repeat rate. Uh, while you're under boost, you might find this flickers around too much. That's an example. If you want to smooth this out and you've got really erratic numbers, you're going to hold it while you're reading live data and then you can change this number. Most people like to run it generally about 10 to 15 and it's a little bit smoother. But if you're running race car, then leave it all the way down at one.